We've already learned how to insert images that have been saved to the computer. Now, let's take a look at the other option that is available, inserting an image from the web. Go back to Insert, then select Image. Now we will use the bottom half of the pop-up window. Prezi will conduct a search for you for the type of image you want. This is powered by the Google search engine. Let's type in Solar System. Before we click search at the right, notice the statement under the text box. Show only images pre-licensed for use in Prezi. When the box next to the statement is checked, Prezi will only show images that can be used without obtaining direct permission from the owner of the image. Since we want to abide by copyright law, leave this box checked. Now click search. The text box with the words solar system remains but now we have a long list of pictures to choose from. You can either click on an image to see the full size picture or use your mouse scroll wheel to cycle through the images. When you find the image you like, click OK at the right side of the text box. Prezi will then process the image to insert it into your presentation. You can now edit the image as you see fit. There's one more item to address when inserting images from the web. If we go back and take a closer look, we can see a warning at the very bottom of the pop-up window. Please remember that any images you upload must comply with the Prezi terms of use. Every educator should take extra precaution to make sure that images in any other content used does not violate copyright law. If you're not sure if you are allowed to use an image or video, make sure to give credit to whomever created it, or simply don't use it at all.